Rain is on the way this weekend, and people who live in Brevard County mm. just can't seem to catch a break. Some areas have been underwater for weeks now. News 6 reporter James Barbero joins us live now from Lake Poinsett. And James, the water is still pretty high where you are right now. Julie, at first glance, you might think this is the lake behind me, but in fact, it's just a cul-de-sac here in the neighborhood, which means, folks, this beautiful home here on the lake, it now has dangerous floodwaters both in front of the house and behind it. Neighbor, neighbors here saying the best they can do right now in this challenging time is continue to stick together. With record flooding. We came up three or four inches in a matter of a couple hours. Neighbors are helping neighbors on Lake Point set. Been out here three days filling sandbags. Sandbags, pumps, anything to stop backyards becoming part of the lake and cul-de-sacs becoming their own lakes. We're concerned, most definitely. What's frightening right now to Cindy Shamrock is her neighbor's house on the lake already taking in water. The water came rushing back. It just overtook everything. Shamrock and 20 neighbors now rushing to protect the home. The woman living here is a widow in her 70s. We barricaded all this off to pull the water away from her house. The water is starting to draw out of the house, so it's, it's working. Still working across the county, crews monitoring road conditions. North Indian River Drive in Cocoa is still underwater. River Road is crazy right now. You can clearly see that the river is coming onto the road. Thankfully today, neighbor Suzanne Strickland is not also feeling heavy winds and rain. That was the story earlier this week. It was like another hurricane, really. It woke me up in the middle of the night. And we now fear there may be some sleepless nights ahead for folks here back on Lake Point set, where right now those efforts continue to place sandbags in front of the home. They're adding dozens more, and there's neighbors over here on this side of my camera stacking up more sandbags as we speak. Much more Julie Ginger from these neighbors during this difficult time coming up tonight at 530. Back to you.